Do we? Can I make myself a drink, please? I can take over this story for you if you like. No, no. I'm nearly there. I can feel it. I'm not going to let him scare me off. I'm good for you. We can meet up later if you like. Talk about what you should be doing next. I don't know. I'm sure it'll be as enjoyable as our last meeting. I'm sorry. Um, I'm just not sure that I'm in the right headspace at the moment. Daniel, I don't want a relationship. Me neither. Is there someone else? There was. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Stop saying sorry. I like you. You're good at your job. And other things. Thank you. But a word of warning. It sounded like he was threatening you back then. I know. I've got to go. Promise me you'll be careful. I don't want to lose you just yet. I promise. Yeah. I'm still stuck in the office. Yeah. No, don't wait up. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, love you too. Bye. Oh, 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 I'm so sorry, love. You okay? Are you all right? Fine. There's your bag there. I'm so sorry. It's my clumsy, clumsy feet. I'm always getting in the way. Sorry, darling. Are you all right, love? Fine. Apologies. Nice perfume, by the way. Sleep again, is that all you ever do? Oh, you are, Xavier. Oh, you idiot. What are you, what are you doing? <sighs> well, that's ironic, isn't it? Hey? You tried to kill me three times, you can't even kill yourself once. Couldn't do it. I don't want to die. Ah. Uh, that's touching. Goodbye, Letter. You'd be deluded if you thought you were ever going to read it. Just go away. Yeah, I could do. But things have changed. Not so easy for me out there anymore. People sniffing around, asking questions, making me nervous. Something's got to give. What do you mean? Well, it's... it's over. <laughs> Don't kill me, please no, don't kill me. I'm no killer. But I have found somebody else. <laughs> please. Somebody else who I'd be more than happy to see chained up in here for the rest of their lives. Hmm. Your replacement plan. 